Hey guys, it's Leia. Today we will talk about how to solve multi-step equations. Multi-step equations are equations that involve more than one step to solve. We will see them in the form of a linear equation. The goal is to isolate the variable on one side of the equation. Here are some helpful steps to follow when solving these types of equations. First, distribute anything if there is anything to distribute. Next, combine any like terms. Then, undo any additive steps. Finally, if there are any multiplicative steps, undo those and that should bring us to our goal. Let's see some examples. Here is our first example. We have 5x plus 3 equals 8. There isn't anything to distribute or combine, so we can go ahead and move on to undoing the additive step. We see that 3 is added to 5x. So to undo it, we subtract each side by 3. We add down and get 5x equals 5. Next, we want to undo the multiplicative step. We see that x is multiplied by 5. So in order to undo that step, we divide both sides by 5. Finally, we get x equals 1, our answer. Next example, we have 8 equals 3 minus 1 plus 2x. There is nothing to distribute, so we go on to combining like terms. We simplify 3 minus 1 to 2. The equation is now 8 equals 2 plus 2x. Now we want to undo the additive step. We see that 2 is added to 2x, so we undo it by subtracting 2 from each side. We add down, and we get 6 equals 2x. Next, we want to undo the multiplicative step. We see x is multiplied by 2, so to undo this, we will divide both sides of the equation by 2. The equation becomes 3 equals x, which is our answer. Last example, we have the equation 2 times x minus 3 equals 10. First, we distribute the 2. This becomes 2x minus 6 equals 10. There aren't any like terms to combine, so next we undo the additive step. We see that 6 is subtracted from 2x, so we add 6 to each side. We add down and get 2x equals 16. Now we want to undo the multiplicative step. We see that x is multiplied by 2, so we want to divide each side by 2. This becomes x equals 8, which is our answer. For more help on this topic, visit www.symbolab.com and click on the Practice tab.